Hello and welcome to the 31st Smash Bros. Analysis. I was wrong, I was a hater. A new character was shown in today's Nintendo Direct, and she's pretty awesome. That character was Rosalina and Luma. To show her off, a new video was released, which I will be analyzing the same way I did the video about Sonic. I'm going to show the whole video first, and then I'll show it again, analyzing as we go. To first summarize the cutscene footage, Kirby rides a warp star to a rainbow road track from Mario Kart. Rosalina appears flying in a similar fashion to the way the Comet Observatory flies in Mario Galaxy. She also uses a launch star from Mario Galaxy, and the carts the characters are riding in are in a Mario Kart 8 style. Before I start the gameplay footage, please remember that if I predict what action an attack is assigned to, it is only speculation. Rosalina can conjure, or whatever, you know, makes a Luma, which is a main mechanic of her moveset. Using her wand, Luma can be sent out to attack for Rosalina. In addition to Rosalina being able to shoot out Luma, the Luma can attack with flying star bits for additional range, and here we see Villager's balloon fight move being broken in action. Also notice that it was blue and not red like in previous screenshots. Will it be randomly colored or is it have they like permanently changed it to blue instead of red? And and look guys, Villager isn't smiling like the serial killer. Now let's just make a different meme about it. Yay! Luma can actually work together back to back with Rosalina to attack from both sides. It seems Rosalina can move while crouching by sliding. Okay then. If Rosalina is constrained like being grabbed here, Luma can still attack for her. I wonder if this will also work if Rosalina is buried, stunned, grabbing a ledge, or laying on the ground. 
Here, Luma can even fight when not on the same height. Also, in this clip, we can see the crowd around the boxing arena. They all look pretty generic, but I can't help but wonder if we'll see some familiar faces in the crowd. Luma can take a hit so that Rosalina can run in by herself and attack. And damn it, that's one of the reasons why I don't like the Ice Climbers. Oh well. A moment of silence for the Luma, who turned into a firework. Oh, hey Link, your only appearance in this video. Oh, bye, I, I guess the area below the tin platforms is actually a pit? Not that pit. Rosalina uses what seems to be her recovery move, and the Toad Brigade ship hurtles through space. One of Rosalina's moves can suck in and bring items to her. This could be really helpful if someone is about to collect an item, you want an item somewhere on the stage, or you want to avoid an item like Rosalina does to Marth here. Three previously not revealed items are seen here, a Pokeball, a Green Shell, and a Fire Flower. Another move that can actually warp the trajectory of projectiles. If you look closely, this attack uses a small blue star that resembles the blue stars Mario can grapple to in Mario Galaxy by pointing at the screen. What appears to be one of Rosalina's taunts. Another look at her recovery, which uses a star effect, maybe to look similar to a launch star. Luma attacking one of Villager's trees. This probably means you can interrupt Villager during his attack, leaving the tree here where it can obviously be attacked. It would be kind of funny if a bee's nest fell out. A closer look at Villager's grab move, and as I suspected, it's the regular Animal Crossing net animation that I doubt will be able to grab ledges, but who knows. And finally, another of Rosalina's taunts. I'm done with the video, but we're not done yet. On to pictures from the official website. So first, the official art. I assume at least one of you was yelling at me this entire video. Yes, Luma comes in different colors, yellow, red, green, blue, and white in fact, and Rosalina's dress has star patterns that appear in the light. Now this image, alright, Rosalina and Mario and Wii Fit Trainer, and they're flying like on the Mario Galaxy box art, and Fox! I'm sorry, but I laughed really hard when I saw Fox in this image. One of the taunts from before, possibly? Luma's charge attack, Rosalina's launch star recovery, possibly her up aerial, it seems small vortex like patterns are a thing with Rosalina's attacks. Beach and Rosalina, on a side note, will Kirby's Rosalina copy ability feature her crown like with Peaches? A very cool picture featuring my old favorite character, one of my probable new favorite characters, and our newcomer. This picture is desktop worthy. Maybe Luma's smash attack? On this subject, will Rosalina be able to use most of her attacks without Luma, or will it be like Olimar where the extra character is needed for most things? Peach and Rosalina both in midair. Interestingly, in the background you can also see Link's red Lockwing from Skyward Sword. Rosalina's projectile stopping move. Here you can take a closer look at the blue star I was talking about earlier. And finally, Rosalina in the 3DS version. But what stage is this? Did the Mario Galaxy stage make it to the 3DS? Or is it just Battlefield at night? Phew, and we're done. So what do you think of Rosalina and Luma, to call them by their official name? When I first heard it I sighed because I didn't think it was possible for her to be in the game in the first place, but once I saw how unique she was, I got really excited and I'm happy we're going to get to play as her. Anyway, that's all I have for this analysis video. Leave your opinions in the comments below, and I'll see you next time for the next Smash Bros. analysis, which will be this Friday. Also, look for a Mario Kart 8 video sometime later this week, maybe before Christmas. Prof, out.